this has been driving me nuts for probably about six weeks or more. So my problem has been that I was unable to have my CPU frame times run clean in under 33 milliseconds. And the reason I need them to be 33 milliseconds is because I need, or less, is because I'm looking for a frame rate in TCS of just 30 frames per second in VR. So that way it's not um, stuttering, perfectly smooth at 30 frames is totally, perfectly acceptable. So what I'm gonna show you is what it looks like when I run in, uh, I've been using this instant action mission kind of as a, a benchmark, just free flight in the Viper. And watch what happens here in just a second. All right, we're sitting idle. Um, there's no data import or export, it's just kind of hanging. You know, I'm not really chewing on anything. You see the frame times are around seven, sec seven milliseconds. But once I cl click fly, watch what happens. Look at that. Look at the frame times. They're all over the place. It's not even that they're sitting at 35 milliseconds or 38 milliseconds or 28 to 38 and just all over the place. So what that causes, of course, is uh, reprojection. You can see that's happening. I'm, I'm dropping frames. Uh, you can st I'm getting stutter. It's awful. It's just a miserable experience. Um, so even at 30 frames a second with this processor, it's just a horrible experience. All right, so what's the problem? Well, we kind of figured it out. So we're gonna quit the mission and close it out. Now, first of all, I should say, this is a 12th gen Intel processor, i9-12900K. It's not overclocked right now, everything's running at, at defaults. The um, graphics card is a 3090, 32 gigs of DDR5 RAM, I and mean, it's, it's a nice machine, it's decent. All right, so what the problem is, is I'm running a couple pieces of software that are outputting data from DCS. One of those is the WinWing throttle. This and also SimShaker for the seat. SimShaker, there it is, SimShaker. So these two files both contribute um, in your save game scripts folder. You can find the export Lua. So if you look at the export Lua, all right, you're gonna see entries here for both the WinWing and the Sim, the uh, Sim Shaker. All right. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna delete the export Lua. All right. First, then we're gonna shut down these various pieces of software. The WinWing is down, and we're gonna turn off the uh, Seat Shaker. And so they're dead now. So there's no export Lua at all. So now what we do? All right. So we're gonna run Sim Shaker. You're gonna see it's gonna recreate the export Lua. Let's look at the export Lua. All right, so you only see the entries for Seat Shaker. All right, so at that point, we're just going to right-click on this, and we're going to go Properties, and we're going to make it read-only. And the reason we're doing that is we don't want the entries for the Wing Wing. And let's run the same mission again. Instant Action, Free Flight. All right, it's running. You saw a couple spikes when it loaded in, but look at it generally. It's running between 9 and 11 milliseconds, 14 tops. As long as I don't go over 33, I'm in great shape and I'll have a perfectly smooth experience. All right? This has been driving me crazy. So, the Wing Wing, oh, by the way, you can still run it. The software will still run. It just won't talk to, um, you know, if you're having it so DCS is talking back to this thing, you don't need that to... To, uh, to use buttons and switches. It still works without DCS talking back to it, as long as we can talk to DCS, and, and we can in this current configuration. So you can see, even with this software running, um, you can still you know, control all the LEDs and so forth, but if we look at the export Lua, since we made it read-only, look at it, it's still just seat shaker, no wind wake. And, well, it's perfectly clean. Look at that. Well, so what does that tell us? Well, their their export is just horrible. And I think if you're you know, some other folks out there might be experiencing the same thing, and if that's true, well, that's how you can fix it.